Okay there, uh, welcome to, uh, PSP Brandon. Uh, just doing this, I how to put any PSP and give it its, uh, different theme colors. Okay, so since I'm on my Mac, I am ha gonna happen to... Open RDC, which is Remote Desktop Connection. Okay, there, um, I am now capturing my, uh, computer screen for my PC. Okay, so, here I have this program called XMB Color. I will post a link to it in the description. And, see, all you do is, it's got the bitmaps which are for the background create right there after you click generate in selected 12 colors it puts together this little thing this bitmap which you can select through your themes now before I before I show you any of this I just want to tell you that messing up with anything in your flash zero could potentially brick your PSP. Uh, so, and you also need custom firmware to access your Flash Zero files. So, make a backup of the original unless you really don't care about that. So, I'm just gonna select some uh, for no apparent reason. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Now with that, twelve. Okay. We click generate. Gives this little thing that says uh, the bitmap has been generated. Now, I can connect to my shared documents on this computer. Um, from my Mac, which I am going to do now. Okay, what we're going to do now is open the PSP up in recovery mode. We do that by holding R and turning on the PSP. Now what we're going to get, do is go down to plugins. Oh, sorry, I'm I mean advanced. Um, and toggle USB flash zero. Make sure that you have this right up here in. Okay, and if you don't want have the time to shut down your PSP. And start it back up. I have custom theme, by the way. By the way, this is a PSP fat. Just so you know, so I am putting slim themes on the PSP fat. Okay, so if you don't have the time, just go over to USB connection. Before you enter it, press select. This will open up the M33 Vish menu. Go down to USB device and scroll to flash zero. When you're done, click exit. Enter the USB device mode. Okay, so once you're done with that, um, file will show up right here. mine on my Mac currently calls it no name I'm going to update um, upload this and I am going to go into this 
Okay. You may have to activate hidden files, whatnot. Uh, but if you're on a Mac, you should have no problem. So here is the bitmap on my um, PSP now. I'm going to do the same. And also go into my shared documents on my PC. And I am going to take this bitmap, the one I ju we just created, and we are going to drag it into the Vish menu. You may want to back it up before doing this. It's going to ask you if you want to replace. And it's done. Now, eject your disk. And exit USB mode. After you have exited USB mode, what you now do is press select and change the USB device back to memory stick. Now what you are going to do is have to reboot the entire PSP system. What you can do is either just hold this for 5 seconds, but I just like to do it the quick way and just take out the battery. And start it up. Okay, I've now started it up. Now, since you probably can't tell, uh, this is black. For some reason, it is showing it as blue on the camera screen. Okay, I can choose to make it deeper normal black, lightish gray, here's a brownish green, I think it's green, here's a light brown, whatnot, sort of purplish blue, red, another bluish color, a green yellow, a yellowish orange, a white, a green, and by month, of course. So here we go, there we are. There you have it. 